Okay, what you just saw was my, or what I call, an M4. Um, I didn't know what to call it for quite a while, uh, except that it was a four-cylinder, basically made out of uh, two of my um, twin cylinders. I want to take that off because you know what that looks like on the inside, except it's just two cylinders. Um, and uh, essentially, it's um, it has the same valve design, except it's just extended down the middle here. Um, and uh, you know, all the cylinders are offset by 90 degrees to make the full 360 for a two-stroke engine. Um, and the two crankshafts are um, hooked together into one right here where the flywheel goes. Now if I wanted to, I could go as many cylinders as I wanted. Um, you know, as I add more efficiency goes down because um, you have more leaks everywhere. But I could make uh, 6, 8, 10, 12, however many I want because I have these gears that can offset at pretty much any angle. Um, the reason I called it an M4 is for mirrored as in um, all the uh, cylinders are mirrored across the axis of the intake manifold. Um, so I think that's kind of cool. Um, anyways, that's my design. I haven't tried it with the shop vac. Um, try that in a second and we'll see what happens. Well, I've already tried a couple times, uh, I don't expect much, but each time I run it at high RPMs, uh, these start to loosen up and the uh, camshaft starts to hit up against the edge, which slows it down a lot. Um, but, you know, we'll uh, see what happens with that, and usually when it's under a load of something, um, it'll stay, so I'll show you that in a second.